All right, folks, Lego 7133 going all the way back to 2002. This is the Bounty Hunter Pursuit. You can see it right there. It is a cool piece. Everything you see right here. Now, uh, first things first, I'll show you the size marker so you get an idea of how big it is or small it is, whichever, whichever uh, half empty, half full type. So you see that it's about, uh, I'm going to say 11 by about 11 or 12. I'm going to show you the packaging. I will tell you it is opened, and we'll see in a moment. It's not only opened, but built up. But I'll show you the packaging for those of you who care about such things. It's in pretty good shape. As you can see, uh, it's been opened on both sides. We'll show you right here. You can see a little bit of uh, wear and tear. I will just rotate it through. Just like that. And there you go. So, uh, as I said, it is opened. And that gives me an opportunity to show you what's inside. What is inside? Well, here we go. It was put together at some point. Ordinarily, when we get a Lego set in uh, to check it, what I like to do is just uh, take everything apart and go on BrickLink familiar with that website and see what's there. I couldn't bring myself to take this apart though, simply because, well look, somebody took the time to put it all together for you. And here are your pieces. So I, I just couldn't do it, um, but I'll show you what is here. Maybe it's complete, maybe it's not. You have the tray as it came right there. Um, and I'll let you judge for yourself. So. As you can see, it's got all these goodies. It's got the original bags. It's got this uh, back from 2002, the Lego Club catalog. It's got the original, um, see right here, the original instructions. Sometimes those alone are worth the price of admission. And then it's got each of the two ships. If you remember that scene back in the prequel, back in the day, I'll show you here very quickly. Uh, we'll even dump these guys out. A couple of little bits and pieces right here that have uh, come off. S the consigner, put it in the little baggie. Are gonna get Zam Wessel, which I think is the uh, important one there. The two little rubber band things, those are for moving these pontoons, call them. They get the little uh, red and green. I remember correctly. I've never put this together myself. I've never owned this one. So we're going off of what our consigner has for. And of course, the little lightsabers with Iwan and Qui Gon. Yo, so some pretty cool stuff right here. I'll show you best as I can what we know about it. So this guy, you're going to see. Here, I'll try to get it close to the. Uh, To the uh, camera as we can. Well, that's a little bit too close. You can see right here the little keys. This effect. Something. There's something kind of rattling in there. One piece floating around. Deck there. See the underside all around. Pretty cool. Chromed pieces. Now this one, as we took it out, piece had come off, and I don't want to mess with it. This was also off. If you can see, this is actually pretty complicated. This goes into there, and then there is a... It actually snaps back. These, I imagine. So that's kind of cool. But one piece just got away. We'll get him back. <laughs> and there he is. So, to the best of my knowledge, this looks to be complete. If it is missing anything, it's just one or two little minor pieces. Find in just collection, I would imagine. Key thing here, the key takeaway is you get, whoop. As always, Zam is on the run. <laughs> Gonna get the uh, Zam Wessel figure, which is a little bit harder to find. Flip it over on the back so you can see that as well. Zam, 
new Jedi, lightsabers, and everything else. I'm going to make this just a little bit nicer. That final hero shot as we put this together very slightly. And leave you this image. So head on over to thebigtoyauction.com where you can see this. All the other goodies we have for you. This and every week. You can leave your pre-bids right now or join us live on auction day. Whichever way you choose to do it, we look forward to seeing you at that auction.